Numbers 6, 24 to 26 is one of the most powerful blessings in the Bible. It's a blessing dictated from God to Moses. The blessing is three blessings in one. The blessings of the Trinity. God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord cause his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. The Lord turn his face towards you and give you peace. The first blessing says, The Lord bless you and keep you. These words are from God the Father and they reveal two things about his nature as Father. He's determined to bless and to keep his children. God the Father is the shepherd of Israel who guards all his children and blesses them with unlimited blessings. The second blessing says, the Lord cause his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. These words of benediction come from the Son of God, the person who puts a face on the Father, Jesus Christ. The Son of God is the radiance of God's glory and the exact representation of his being. But God causes his glory to shine in the face of Jesus Christ. It is Jesus Christ who causes his face to shine upon humanity. The third blessing says, the Lord turn his face towards you and give you peace. These words are from the Holy Spirit. The person of God who not only reveals but also turns God's face towards humanity and enables humans not only to understand but to experience God. The Holy Spirit is the engine of God's peace, the peace that surpasses all human understanding. Philippians 4 7. A blessing, a benediction, traditionally has to be spoken by a man. Or a human being. Traditionally in Jewish culture, at Shabbat, which means Saturday or the Sabbath, Shabbat, the Jewish father or the patriarch of the family would speak these blessings over his son. I pray that you have the grace to receive these blessings. To this day in, in Jewish families, the Father will speak this blessing, a one very similar over his son. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord cause his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. The Lord turn his face towards you and give you peace. May the Lord give you the dew of heaven and of earth, an abundance of grain and new wine. Let people serve you, and nations bow down to you. Be master of your brothers, and let your mother's sons bow down to you. Let everyone be cursed with curses, who curses you, and favoured with blessings, who blesses you. 
May the Lord make you like Ephraim and Manasseh. May your mouth speak with wisdom. May your heart meditate with reverence. May your hands do the work God has given you. May your feet hasten to follow the path that God has laid out for your life. May the Lord's full will for you be accomplished. May the spirit of wisdom and counsel, understanding and power, the spirit of knowledge and the fear of the Lord be upon you. May you prosper in all things and be in health even as your soul prospers. May you live abundantly before the Lord. May the Lord strengthen your hand and be a help to you whenever you call. May the Lord bless all the skills of your hands and be pleased with the work of your hands. May you be beloved of the Lord and be protected by him. May the Lord bless your land with all the precious gifts of heaven and earth that you may give a great inheritance to your children. May God bless you and your works in the world that you may draw others to God's mountain. May God bless your home, that your sacrifices may end in abundance and your house be filled with treasure. May God choose the leader's portion for you, that you may carry the Lord's righteous will in the land. May you be ever like a young lion, protecting your family and defending justice for your people. The blessings of the patriarchs I pray that you have the grace to open your spirit and receive these blessings in Jesus' name. Similarly, these blessings will be spoken over the daughter. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord cause his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. The Lord talk, turn his face towards you and give you peace. May the Lord make you like Rachel and like Leah, like Sarah and Rebecca, who built the house of Israel. May your entire life be fruitful May you multiply and have great success. May all your endeavours end in abundance. Blessed are you of the Lord, my daughter, for you have been kind and generous. The Lord God is your God, and his people are your people. May all the peoples know of certainty that you are a virtuous daughter. May you be in health and prosper, even as your soul prospers. May your mouth speak with wisdom. May your heart meditate with reverence. May your hands do the work that God has given you. May your feet hasten to follow the path that God has laid out for your life. May your entire life be fruitful. May the Lord's full will for you be accomplished in your life. May the Spirit of the Lord the spirit of wisdom and understanding, the spirit of counsel and power, the spirit of knowledge and the fear of the Lord be upon you. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with you both now and forevermore. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord cause his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. The Lord turn his face towards you and give you peace. The word peace in Hebrew is shalom. Shalom, harmony, harmony. 
Shalom. Jesus Christ is the Prince of Peace. The Shah Shalom. Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace, shalom, goodwill to men. The Lord's plan for mankind was shalom, shalom. Psalm twenty nine eleven. The Lord bless His people with shalom. Harmony, harmony. The Holy Spirit is the agent of God's shalom, the shalom that passes understanding. Philippians 4, 7. The presence, the harmony of God, union with God. The word Jesus in Hebrew is Yeshua and means salvation. The God that brings salvation. Acts 2.21 states, All, all, all who call on the name of the Lord will be saved. The word saved in this passage in Greek is sozo. And more fully translates, He'll be healed. He'll be healthy, made whole. Delivered, he'll be prospered. He'll be prospered. Psalm 91 14 to 16 states, I rescue all who cling to me, I protect whoever knows my name, I answer everyone who invokes or calls upon me. I am with them when they are in trouble. I bring them safety and honour. I give them life, long and full, and I show them how I can save. John, the beloved disciple who lived with Jesus Christ, wrote these words. The first letter of John 4.16 4, God is love, God is love, God is love. If you pray this prayer aloud, and from your heart, it will, it will change your life. The prayer of salvation. Lord Jesus Christ, please come into my life and into my heart. I am sorry for my sins and shortcomings. Please forgive me. I welcome you as Lord and Saviour of my life. Please fill me with your Holy Spirit of love and grant me the grace of a divine prayer language that I may talk in other tongues as in Acts 2 4. The word Holy Spirit can seem alarming. It's a poor translation of the original, the paraclete, the coach, the counsellor, the guide, the good shepherd, the one that leads. It's similar to having 
to being a footballer and being given a football coach. To have someone to coach you and guide you all your life. To show you the way. To talk in tongues is a blessed relief. It's a release. It feels like a like a champagne cork being blown out of a bottle. It's a relief. It's freedom itself. It's freedom. To talk in tongues is a right of every Christian believer, if they so desire. If you desire the gift of speaking in tongues, as I pray, if you have the, the courage just to open your mouth, as I pray, just as an act of faith, the courage just to open your mouth. I pray, I pray, Abba, 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 Father God, Abba, Father, pour your breath, pour your breath, pour your breath, your Rawak, pour your breath, Father God, into this, your child. Fill this child, Father God, fill this person you love, Father God, with fresh breath. Fill them with your Rawak, your holy spiration, your breath. Fill them with your breath, Father God. Grant them the gift and the graces to speak in other tongues, Father. Grant them all the gifts and graces that you granted me. Pour out your breath. Pour out your breath into this your child, Father God. The easiest way to speak in other tongues is to be prompted by somebody that does speak in tongues. Initially, when I first spoke in tongues, somebody led me, I was led. The easiest way is to mimic, mimic another person speaking in tongues for perhaps 10, 15, 20 seconds. And all of a sudden, you'll find if you're prepared to forego the folly of attempting, you'll find that in a few seconds, maybe five seconds, 10, 15, 20 seconds, maybe a minute, your tongue will no longer be mimicking, no longer mimicking that other person, but the Holy Spirit will take control. You'll feel peace and calm. You'll feel a blessed release. As I now speak in tongues, if you're prepared to attempt to mimic me and feel foolish for a few seconds, you will you will speak in a divine prayer language that will enhance your life. Lama, 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 Lama. Lama, 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 Lamarashia, Lamara, Lamarashia, Lamara, Lamarashia, Lamara, Lamarashia, Lamara, Lamarashia Gasana, Lamara, Lamarashia Gasa, Lamarashia Gasa, Lamarashia Gasa, Lamarashia Gasa. Lamara, Lamara Gishama, Shandara Gibose, Yataga Babara Shana, Oshiama, Yaka Barashia, O Daga Babara Shana, Woya Mama, Woya Mama, Woya Mama, On Sandara Bushe, Yela Mara Shinda, Waya Mama. Araboshia, 
Yalla la la barashin Baya shand Woshiyama Woshiyama Shimagasand Ya bagasa Abasina Ya babarashi Shiyagasa Abarashana May the Lord bless you and keep you and cause his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. The Lord turn his face towards you and give you peace. May the Lord give you the peace of the Holy Spirit, the agent of God's peace, the peace that surpasses all human understanding, the Shah Shalom, the Prince of Peace. May the Holy Ghost flood your mind, your body, your soul and your spirit. O Ramashana, Aya Baba San, Aparashin Narabushi. Jesus Christ was greeted every day of his life, was greeted by Mary and by Joseph, and everybody that he met in Jerusalem with the words, Shalom, 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 Jesus. Shalom, Shalom, Ramashina, Shalom. It states in Romans five seventeen. Jesus Christ will cause everyone to reign in life who receives the free gift that he does not deserve of being made righteous. I pray of the gift to receive all the graces and the anointing of the Lord Jesus Christ, of the Father, Son and Holy Spirit. It says in the first letter of John 5.13 I have written all this to you so that you who believe in the name of the Son of God may be sure that you have eternal life. I pray that the Lord increases your faith. Your faith. I pray the Lord increases your hope and increases your love. She agasan darabushi, or agiba gabrabu gabrushi, or ya dagasan darabushi. It states in scripture May the Lord enlighten the eyes of your mind, so you may see what hope your, his, call, his call holds for you. May the Lord enlighten the eyes of your mind, so you may see what hope is called holds for you. The word mind in this passage, in the Hebrew, is yester, yester, and more fully means imagination, imagination. It means may the Lord enlighten the eyes of your imagination, so you may see what hope is called holds for you. May the Lord sanctify the eyes of your imagination. May the Lord God sanctify the eyes of your imagination. May the glorious light of Jesus Christ enter deep into your conscious and subconscious mind and heal you of all the scars and traumas, of all sadness, sorrow and despair. May the eyes of your mind be sanctified by the glorious light of Jesus Christ. May you be healed in mind, body, soul and spirit. O Ramashi Agasandra Bushi, Waiya Marashana, O Ya Gabara Gabara Bushana. Jesus Christ stated, I am, I am the Lord that healeth thee. I am the Lord, I am the Lord that healeth thee. O Rashi Abasana, Ya Gabara Shia, Ora gabara gabara bushin, ya gisi abasana, be thou healed, be thou healed, shia sandarashi, o ya gebabarashan, 
O wawawa shiyama, be thou healed. Shia garashana, arabarabushana, be thou made whole. Shan sanda garashana, in the holy and glorious name of Jesus Christ. O ya de geba gabarabushana, O ya geba baragabagabarabushana, O ya shia gasana, aragabagabarabushana, be thou healed. Be thou healed, be thou made whole. Shan si raboshe, ya ga ba barasha, yo hishishena, shan ba raboshe, o ya ga ba barasha, o ra ba ga ba raboshe, ha ya ke sindara boshe, o ya da ga ba 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 ga ba raboshe, o ya ke ra ba re ke ba ga raboshe. The Holy Spirit in Scripture is also called the Spirit of Glory, the Spirit of Glory. Jesus Christ Jesus Christ prayed prayed for you he prayed that his glory the glory of God should come upon you it states in scripture Lord Father God share share my glory with them to the full to the full I pray that the glory of the Lord Jesus Christ, the glory of God, the glorious Holy Spirit, comes upon you and heals you in mind, body, soul, and spirit, that you be filled with the utter fullness of God. Ya ba si ya ba ha ba ra ba ra bo shen be thou healed be thou made whole. Ya ra ba ra ba ra bo shen sho ke ra ma ra ba ga ba ra bo shi shen o ya da ga ba 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 ga ba ra bo shen. Jesus Christ made this statement. I came, I came that they should have life to the full. In abundance, until it overflows. I pray you receive life to the full, in abundance, until it overflows. In the holy and glorious name of Jesus Christ, I pray that I plead the sanctifying blood of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ, over your life from these declarations. She agasan darabushi, be thou healed, be thou made whole. Shangan san darabushi, ya ge ba 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 barasha, san darabushi, yoga san darabushi, ha ba barasha. It states in the scriptures, He who the sun sets free, is free indeed. O ya ge ba ba ra ga ba rabusha, o ra ga ba ra ba ga ba rabushi. O ya de ge de ge ba 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 ka prabushin, O ra ba ra ba ka pre ba ka prabushin, Shia ba ba san, Wa ya ya ma sin, O Shia ka san, Ara ka ba ka pre ba ka prabushin, O ya san de sin, O ya ka ba prabushin, O ya ba 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 san, Shia ma ma, Wa 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 ma san, Ara ba prabushin, Ye ma 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 san. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord cause his face to shine upon you. May the Lord be gracious unto you. May the Lord turn his face towards you and give you peace. O ya mara barabu garabushana, O ya da gaba baba garabushi. Ya sandara bushi, ora mara bara bushana, ya sandara bushi. In the holy, the holy and glorious name of Jesus Christ, the Shah Shalom, the Prince of Peace.